Hi there guys, it's Adam Martin here and welcome back to a very special instalment of the Now Review because this week, in the month of November, we are taking a look at a very special Now release. This is Now That's What I Call Now, 100 Hits from 100 Nows. Now That's What I Call Now, 100 Hits from 100 Nows. So this is a very special album. I mean, in the month of November, we're getting a lot of Now albums. And a lot of you on the Sunday Catch-Up asked me, are you going to review Now Now? Are you going to review all the albums in November? And the answer is yes, I will, uh, bits at a time. I'm going to review this one first. Next week is the release of Now That's What I Call Easy, so I'll cover that. But don't worry, as you can see, Rock and Roll is there. Disney Bedtime is there. We will get to them at some point. Don't fret and frown. But for now, we're going to have a look at this. So look at this cover. This is absolutely gorgeous, brimming with color and history i mean around the title you've got bunches of now so there's the first one for example of course now 100 is there somewhere where is it there's now 100 down there and you've got a spattering of other co covers and of course in the title are all the other nows this is just such a gorgeous cover i'm really glad they went with this sort of design it looks absolutely beautiful and when we have a look at the spine it says now it's what i call now 100 hits from 100 nows which is quite nice and this is five cds that's right, not three, not two, five. You're getting a lot of bang for your book. And it's, it's in a very nice case. I was wondering how they were going to do this, whether they were going to do like the old fat box style or something else, but this is really lovely and you'll see the inside. But of course, let's have a look at this all important, gigantic track list. So on five CDs, uh, CD one, as you can see, is a hit from now one all the way to now 20. And I'll talk about the track list later on. I don't necessarily agree with all of them, but they are pretty damn good. Disc 2 is now 21 to now 40. CD 3 is now 41 to now 60. CD 4 is now 61 to now 80. And CD 5 is now 81 to now 100. Starting off with Karma Chameleon by The Culture Club and finishing off with George Ezra's Shotgun. So, as I said, I'll talk more about the tracks in a minute, but of course, I think you're all interested. Let's have a look at what's inside. So the first thing to note is this, which is a lovely little booklet stylized. Of course, they've got to get the social media aspects on there. But I mean, you know, you flick inside. Of course, the Now Music app. You can't get away from the Now Music app. So what you have here is basically a little tidbit about each song, which is really great. And it tells you about where they hit in the charts, what it meant for the band. It's just a really nice bit of information. So you really get the sense of the history about these songs. And right in the middle you have this lovely piece of artwork, zoom out a bit there, which has all the different covers all the way from now 1 to now 100. Truly a stunning bit of artwork, I'd love to have that framed and on my wall. That is essentially the booklet, just something really nice to have because a lot of these spin-offs don't come with booklets necessarily, so it's nice that they took the effort with this one, a very special now. But of course we must see where the CDs are held, so I'll show you that now. So how this works is it's in a little fold-out case, and look at that, that is disc one, let's see if we can get it out. So they come in these nice little sleeves, they almost remind me of record sleeves. So it shows you uh, the covers of the Now's feature, so Now 1 all the way to Now 20, which of course was the first Now to feature the Now iconic sort of titling style, so that's disc one. And on the back, you have the individual track list and which now they come from which again is such a really nice touch I think to know which now these are coming from I mean it's pretty obvious but it's just nice to have listed here as well so that is CD1 I'm gonna put this aside and we're gonna take a look at the others so here is disc 2 from now 21 to now 40 all the covers there and of course here is your track list on the back some interesting great songs in there I'm gonna put that down there here is disc 3 from now 41 to now 60, again nicely packaged, and there is your track list getting into the early 2000s now of course. Here is CD4 which is now 61 to now 80, and again here is the track list for such thing, there we go, nice there, I'm going to put you right there. And finally, disc number 5, featuring 91 to now 100, and that is the track list there. I'm going to put that, sorry, just over the booklet there. 
So, what is left to talk about? Well, it is the inevitable track list of these things. So, for example, now one. The first song that springs to my mind is the very first song, which was You Can't Hurry Love by Phil Collins. Phil Collins, uh, unless I've absolutely missed it, is nowhere to be seen on here, which I think is an absolute shame. He was such a big influence on the Nows in the early years. Uh, Karma Chameleon's a great song, don't get me wrong, but I would have gone with You Can't Hurry Love personally. Um, what else did I not agree with necessarily? Well, it's not that I don't agree with. Don't get me wrong, all the songs here are fantastic, no matter way how you look at it. Let's say again, Now 17, they chose Kingston Town by UB40. A great song by any accounts, but why not I Wish It Would Rain Down by Phil Collins? That was just a shame. But listen guys, overall, I mean, a hundred songs on five CDs, you can't really complain. And the fact that these are all like hit songs as well, none of them's really a dud. I think that says something pretty special about this album. Just gonna put that there. So, where can you pick this up? Well, I picked it up brand new HMV, got it on the day of release. It is a bit more expensive than the regular new now spin-offs because obviously this is five discs, there's more songs, there's more content. So it is currently £14.99, round it up to £15 new. You'll probably it'll get it secondhand later on, but make sure that it has all five discs, and if you want to be completionist, make sure it has the booklet in it as well. This will be available in HMV for quite a long time, I think. And also, is it worth the purchase? Well, I mean, it's just, it's such a special made, specially made album. I mean, I know they've done stuff up here in the past, like now 25 years, now 30 years, but this more than any encapsulates the last 35 years in music from 1983 to 2018, because you have one song from every now. Now 25 years and 30 years, they're great albums, but they didn't have one song from each individual now, at least I don't think they did. But this does, and it's just, it's such a nice history piece. Do you know what I mean? Like. To have a song from every now is something quite special in this day and age. I mean, if you don't own any nows at all and you want to get into it, this is a definite surefire hit to start. You're getting 100 hit songs across all kinds of nows, you know, for a, a really great price. I mean, £15 for 100 songs, that's not bad at all. I really don't think it is. So, if you're new to now or if you just love the now series, it's definitely worth a purchase no matter who you are, honestly. I can't imagine someone wouldn't like this album. You could argue, yes, I own all the nows and... You know, if I own all the nows, then why would I buy this? It's just nice to have just because it's so special and it's all these in one package. So well done to Now Music for this. Congratulations on 100 nows, 35 years of sticking around and being in the business. But honestly, if you're a fan of Now or just music in general, you really need to own this very, very special set. So that is all for this week of the Now Review. As I said, I will be covering the other releases. Here's how it's going to go. So the next episode is going to be Now That's What I Call Easy as that comes out a few days before, and then the week after it'll be Now That's What I Call Love Songs, because that comes out a few days after. I am aware now 101 comes out on Friday the 23rd. My response to that is I'm going to try and do a review on that on Friday the 23rd, push the I Don't Review back to Saturday so that everyone's happy. But don't worry, as I said, now rock and roll, now Disney bedtime, we will cover those, but it might be more into December. There are a lot of releases going on this month for now. They skimped out on October, so they're going full force for November and I can't wait to delve into each of those with you on this channel. So thank you very much for watching, please like the video, share it around, subscribe, and until the next one, I will see you guys next time. 100 hits from 100 now. Now, that's what I call now.